Well, as the rate on figures of drug abuses in the country continues to rise, staff and students of mass communication at the Federal Polytechnic in Choir State embarked on a campaign against drug abuse. Coordinator of the campaign, Chuk Sukoji, said the alarming rate of youths and Nigerians indulging in drug abuse prompted the campaign. Well, he, they attributed the development of the social menace, corruption in the system, and called for intensified sensitization on the path of religious, political, and all stakeholders. You go to the streets and you look at the rate youth abuse drugs in their smoking hem indiscriminately. It actually says a lot about the policy on ground to forestall the drug abuse as a, as a scourge. So now the challenge is for them to increase orientation and that is what we are doing. Now if we can do this at the school level and we move to town to still do the same, then the government can do more. The government has the resources to do more. We have to mount intensive campaign and if you want to do that you have to you know, do it you have to involve the, 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 the religious leaders traditional leaders and uh, different gov every government organs you know the institutions too even if you go to the primary school it's happening there now primary school level it's happening at the primary school level secondary school too they are involved not to talk of notational institutions. NDLA uh, chairman, the Brigadier General Marwa, came out recently to raise alarm that Nigeria is sitting on a keg of gunpowder, if you are not careful, that this issue of drug abuse, will, in fact, we, have, we can see now, some of these security issues of the, the banditry, the Boko Haram, they are even related to drug abuse. If you arrest them, you see that in their luggage you find a lot of drugs that they use. The same thing with armed robbery, with them, the same thing with kidnapping. So drug abuse is at the root of so much evil in this country that we need to do more. We used to claim that youths are the leaders of tomorrow. But it's unfortunate to know that these youths are becoming drug abusers. Many have landed in psychiatric homes, many are um, roaming around the streets naked because of drug abuse. Many have dropped out of schools and it is very unfortunate. This is really evident that drug abuse has no positive impact. It only has negative impact. So we have to stop this act. It should be shunned. 